guys. Today we will talk about discrete uniform distribution probability. In probability theory and statistic, the discrete uniform distribution is a system, systematic probability distribution whereby a finite number of values are equally likely to be observed. For example, if we have n in any group, any, any, anything, we will take example for n contains like 1, 2, and 3. The probability of being, of the probability of choosing number 2 is equal to the probability of choosing number 3 and also the same thing going to number 1. So the formula for the discrete con uh, uniform distribution will be 1 over n. Another name uh, for discrete uniform distribution is known as equally likely outcomes. You know that we have two types of uh, uniform distribution, which is discrete and continuous. So in this video, our focus will go to discrete. I will show you this graph to explain more about uh, our uniform discrete distribution. For example, we have two axes. This one is fx and this one is x-axis. We have here a, b, and c. Like all a, b, and c, they are in group n. The probability of a is, for example, 1 over n. This is the formula. So, in discrete uniform distribution, all the members of the n group have equal probability. So, from the graph, we can explain more, this graph explains more about uniform discrete distribution. Uh, this is a, the example of discrete uniform distribution. Okay. The question is, a set of cards is numbered 4, 7, 10, 13, until 1, 151. The variable C to represent the value of a card selected at random. So we got two questions. A, find the EC means the mean. And B, find the grand of. We want to find EC, the mean. So given here, x equal to 1, 2, 3, and 4. So given here too, c equal to 3x plus 1. And the formula given for to find ex is n plus 1 over 2. Now, from the equation given just now, 3n plus 1 equal to 151. 3n equal to 150. n equal to 50. Right. So, with ef n plus 1 divided by 2, so here, we can find the answer is 51 over 2. The last part is to find EC is E 3x plus 1 include in EC to find the 3x. 3EX Plus one, and we insert the value that we have, we have written, we have written just now, equal to seventy five, seventy seven point five. Now, we want to find the variance. So the formula given is variance x equal to n plus one n minus 1 divided by 12. So, 51 
times 49 equal to 12. The final answer is 3x plus 1 into c and we will get uh, 3 the power of 2 variance x and we will get 8 t3 over 4 times 9 and the final answer 1874.25 Hello, I will continue with another example for discrete uniform distribution or we can call it as probability mass function. So if there is x which is a role of a pair 6 sided die, which is any regular type of a die. So how is the shape going to be? It's like this. What is the probability of getting any of the next outcomes, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, which is the phases of the die. And 1 over 6, which is the probability of any particular outcome. Which, which we can call it as Vx. So the probability of getting any one of those will be the same, will be like equally probability, which we call it as uniform discrete distribution. So it will be like this. All of them will be equal to one over six. They will have the same probability, something like that. So what if this is a die, right? What if someone delete one of the die phases? Like for example, a phase of a die that contains two, it will become only one. So there is no phase with a two, but there is two phase with a one. And the other phases are still the same. So it will be no longer called as uniform distribution, but it will have another name. So the probability will be like next. 3 to 6 will be the same, but there will be no probability for 2 and 1 will be double because there is a probability that 1 show up twice if we roll a die. So this is discrete distribution, but it's, not, it's no longer uniform. And this is the example and I hope it was useful and make you understand what is uniform discrete distribution is all about. And if you like this video, give, please give it a thumbs up. And thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you.